tell us your name, where you're from, and what you do. My name is Sherry Goodman. I'm from San Jose, California, and I'm an editor and writer for a high-tech company. Why did you choose Belize to volunteer? Well, the, the Belize was the service trip for my daughter's school, but I was very happy to learn that it was Belize because I've always wanted to come here. I heard it's a very beautiful country, and it is, and I was very glad to go to a place where everyone speaks English. How was the service the local staff and coordinator provided to you while in Belize? I think the local staff has been absolutely wonderful. Um, any questions that we might have, they are very happy to answer, even if six different people have asked them the same question before. <laughs> they don't lose uh, patience. And um, very positive and supportive. What's a typical work day like? Well, we get up um, around 7, eat breakfast at 7.30, and then after cleaning up the kitchen and dining room, we get to work on whatever we're going to do and stop for lunch at about 11.30 and then continue working uh, into the afternoon until, uh, basically until we're tired <laughs> <laughs> or until we're done with our task and then um, clean up for dinner. What's the most surprising thing you experienced while volunteering here? I think that um, I have been delighted and surprised at my interaction with the children. Uh, they are so warm and open and eager to relate to us and the little bit of connection that I've had with some of the kids who may not even be very verbal and yet they know how to connect, it's, it's been quite wonderful. Tell us about your accommodation and meals. Uh, we are in dorm room accommodations. Um, my daughter and I are in the same room uh, together and uh, we have fans on both beds so it makes it uh, comfortable at night. Um, the meals are simple but actually quite delicious. Uh, the only thing that we have wished for more of is uh, greenery and vegetables and we are starting to get that so uh, I have no complaints. What was the most challenging thing you experienced while volunteering in Belize? Uh, well, working in the hot sun, probably doing, doing physical labor in the hot sun. What type of donation can other volunteers bring for the program? Uh, things that, that will be obvious that are needed and go out and just buy it. Are you willing to speak to other potential ABA, ABB volunteers? Sure. Any tips for future volunteers coming to Belize? Come with an open heart and uh, I think you should plan on some spending money to, to get for uh, things that are needed around here. You'll see it. Thank you for volunteering in Belize and we hope you have you to have you back with us soon. Thank you.